What's good YouTube? Nigga PBG here. Today's video talking about Mario Odyssey and the Switch, man. The Switch is amazing, dope console. Selling like high case going crazy. It might reach the top game console of all time, you know what I'm saying? Surpassing that PS2. Maybe so. We gotta see. But the topic today is Mario Odyssey, man. I, I wanna do a video like man, that game overhyped to me. I mean, yes. Mario Odyssey is overhyped to me, man. I mean, it's a good game. It, it's a good game. It's a great game. But it's like, is that all? You know what I mean? I just seen the news today talking about DLC, Luigi's balloon thing or something. Collecting balloons. Bro, I'm, man. They really, okay, I know it's free, but really? Who finna have fun collecting balloons? Like, what? Come on, man, and the Mario game, the levels are amazing, the levels look great and everything, but collecting moons and that's it? Am I the only one who, like, kind of, like, bored with that? Collecting moons. And then the bosses are weak. From the bosses I fought, man, them, them, them dudes that's on the little uh, pirate ship flying around, them dudes are extremely weak. And I know you're going to say, well, Mario bosses always hit him on the head three times. But from what I remember on the Game Boy Advance games, maybe I'm just comparing to that because I haven't really played the Mario games on, like, GameCube and Wii. But the Mario bosses on Game Boy Advance were hard, challenging, man. I mean, these couple of bosses on Mario Odyssey, kind of simple, man. Just dodge the fire, dodge the dude that spin, dodge the flamethrower, jump on his head. It, it just seems easy to me. Or maybe because the hat, the hat so... So versatile. Maybe that makes it simple. Somebody put it down below in the comments. Like, is that it? But man, Mario Odyssey kind of boring to me, man. Like collecting moons and putting them on the ship and traveling to the next board. That's basically what it is. I guess the part of the game is just to enjoy the scenery, which is good for the first part. But it's like after like 10 hours of gameplay, it's like, okay, what else can I do? You know what I mean? Like, and I'm just thinking like, uh, that's overrated because. The, Zelda Breath of the Wild game dope way 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 better than me man and that game won game of the year I'm glad it did but I'm just saying Mario Odyssey man 10 out of 10 I don't know about that man let's give it a 7 I said 8 but not no 10 man I mean like it's boring or maybe I'm just looking at it from like a, a older perspective because I guess younger kids like 12 11 might really enjoy finding moons but it's like and Mario games are fun. Maybe it's just the Odyssey game is like collecting moons and that's all, moving to the next stage. That's not that fun to me, y'all. But this this was a little short video. Just like, man, Mario Odyssey is overrated. Zelda way better. Put a comment down below. Let me know y'all thoughts, man. Is Mario Odyssey overrated? Did you really love the game? Is it a 10 out of 10? No, I think it's a 7, 8. But yeah, let me know your thoughts, man. It's nigga PBG signing out.